So in this video, let's quickly take a look at the, the split screen multitasking on the iPad and how you can actually adjust the size to make it smaller and whatever you feel like is the right thing. Anyways, you start the multitasking by opening up any app and here at the top of the page, you have the three dots in here. So you're going to tap on it and make it go to split view, so the split screen. And now you can open up any other app. I'm going to choose it to be something. So let's say it's going to be uh, the Safari web browser. And I'm actually here in the Google page in the sign in and I'm using the split screen uh, where I have uh, the app store here on the left and a Safari page on the right. And here in the middle, you can see that it's like split in here and there's like a black stripe actually separating it. But here, if you zoom it in, there is like a handle. So this means that you can grab this thing and actually slide it over to adjust the size. So, I mean, you can just freely put, for example, put it here, but you can go like here. So you have like certain zones or you can move as far as Apple allows you. So it, it cannot be like anywhere. The position cannot be like random. It's going to be like split in the between or make a one page or one app bigger than the other. But this is pretty much how you can make the split screen smaller. I mean, you cannot put the three apps in here. And if you really want to have just like this, a little view of one app you can just grab this like here place it on top and now it's like a floating window as i like to call it so you can for example put it in here and whenever you just don't need it just slide it back use your safari window however you want and now just bring up uh, bring this app back whenever you need it this is my favorite way of doing that so you can use it uh, this way as well and this is definitely making the the icons or making the app smaller the window smaller in a the split view it's not really split view anymore as long as you don't just slide it here so yeah to bring it back just grab the icon and just make it go like this well besides that i don't think that there is anything else which you should know in order to close one window and keep the other you can just swipe up individually on these windows or swipe up on both of them so this is how you can actually exit it as well if you don't want to so yeah this is an option as well thanks a lot for watching for more videos about the ipad multitasking click here and we can see each other there